saying? I want to welcome East Atlanta Zone, So Icy Entertainment, OJ the Juice Man. Hi! It's your boy OJ the Jew, man. You already know the building, man. 32 Entertainment in the building. We swear it up. We shout it, shout it, man. You already know the building. We here, Bold Credit Day for annual. Yes, sir. Hosting and sponsored by the kid right here in your face. Yes, sir. Had a good time. You already know that right shit ain't nothing. You know what I'm talking about? With no hood, nigga. We stand out that shit. You feel me? Jew, man, the motherfucker. You already know the building. Shout it, shout it, rocking with like Clown Stack and Yes, sir. Alright man, let's return it. So we had the uh it's the fourth annual. Fourth annual. This is the fourth annual Bold Crest Day. So how does it feel to see your neighborhood? I know you right from across the street in Sun Valley. See your neighborhood come together years later after y'all went to high school, after everybody done growed up. It things end up like it is, man. Everybody's all having you know, a good time. It's just a beautiful thing. Blessed to be here. Happy to see everybody come out. You know, just enjoy the environment. And they, you know, what it is with me. I keep it too on. How did you actually get the name OJ the Juice Man? Oh, uh, man. Oda Williams Jr., man. You know, OJ, man. That's God, your God, real God, name? Sure. I wouldn't be telling everybody. <laughs> hey, what my name <laughs> is? <laughs> How you start rapping? Oh, uh, man. I've been rapping for a minute. We started out little kids, you know. Really just got serious in 99 and started doing the mixtapes and stuff. Blowed up in like uh, 2000, 2008. Really not blowed up, just really say got on the radio or whatnot. Uh -huh. Well, that's, I remember, I remember you going up in the leap a long yeah, no, time ago. And everything on me. Everything on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's one, yeah man. So, how did you feel to go from, from, from going up at the leap saying saying everything on me? To the position of uh, uh, being with So Icy Records and having hit hit records and being going all around the country and doing your thing, man. From then to there, how was the transition? And, uh, tell me some of your, you know, some of the things you went through on that road. I mean, you know, it was just good. You know, blessed the uh, folks um, outside of Atlanta even know my music. You know, we keep it one on and still put that you made music out that I continuously been putting out. Not changing that swag up in no kind of way and just keep it one on and put that thirty two out. That's what's happening, man. Uh, what's your current status with your management? Oh, uh, man, I'm, I'm, on a, I'm on a new management right now, like convenience store. You know what I'm talking about? Swap hey. folks here three months. You feel me? Right now, we're on the management of Oda William, man, producer out of OJ the Juice, man. You feel me? Out here working everything, booking and everything. Still got Johnny Cavell in there doing a little booking. But over this side, it's 32, man. We rocking like cut off stock and we don't bought none. You feel me? And I'm one man, one money. Nobody. You feel me? Real nigga shit. Man, that's what's happening, man. OJ all over. Every time I go do show, out of town, OJ, hey, OJ the Juice Man coming Friday. I be like a Wednesday. I be like, yeah, man, yeah. man, my partner missing each other. Yeah, yeah, missing each other like a fool. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Which one? Which one of these cities you get the most love in? Uh, man, I, I believe all of them that I don't hit the little market that I did hit, like the Carolinas and Memphis and Florida and you know, got down up top and got down Minnesota and shit like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so, as far as your yeah. date status, what you single? Yeah. You got a girl. No comment. No comment. Man. I just keep it too honest, man. Hey, man. I feel so which, which, which one of these industry, industry chicks? You know what I'm saying? We got a lot of industry trick chicks out there. Tricks, chicks, whatever they is, man. You know, we got a lot of women out there these days. You know, you can go from uh, uh, from the top to the bottom, from Cheryl Underwood to Cat Stacks and everything in between. Damn. That ain't, that ain't no bad. You know, like, I heard of Christina Milian on the market. <laughs> so I mean, what what what, what cheat would you smash, man? And what cheat would you pay? I mean, you know, I really bad enough on all of them. I ain't saying that. I'm trying to get that damn bad. I know that's right, man. You got family, bro. Yeah. Most of them want something, man. You got to look out for my new TV show, Broke Begging Bitches of Atlanta. <laughs> yeah, airing every first of the month, man. We going in. I want you to tell the crowd, man, tell your fans, what's the most interesting, most wildest thing ever happened to you on the road? I'm talking about when everything just went ham. A real story, man. Your folks want to hear it, man. Shit, we was some of them niggas shooting at a nigga in the club. Forgot what state we was in. <laughs> got them gunshots going up and shit. I'm trying to go in them phone. I just hear gunshots, buddy. I don't know what they're going on. They're shooting at me or in the crowd. They're about to wild shit out on, man. Wow, so they shoot in the club. Yeah. Well, you got a free Steve motherfucker, man. They got all types of shit niggas shit in the club these days, man. Gangsta rappers, you know, they all. Uh, they go out and uh, you know, live they lyrics. You know what I mean? They really live. They really pump themselves up to be that person who they who they rap about and what they rap about, man. How do you feel about that? And what is your approach to your music and the way you live? Um, you know, I can't really speak to nobody else. I know my environment and music that I spit. You know, it is what I do. You know, I don't spit that gangster shit. I spit, I spit that trap too. Hey. So you know, know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about on that. So it is what it is. You know, that TV is trap TV. 
something, you feel me, go so, you know, and I can't really speak on nobody else but have, I don't count other nigga pockets, you know what I'm saying, so, I just look at it, I, me, I, I grind, you know what I'm saying. How you live, it. tell us about this stamina, man. Oh, the stamina on food, man, <laughs> down there like DM, man, catch a broad intercept, going out of here, bro, pump like a jet rapper. Pump like a jet rapper, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah, do you get oral sex? Nah, what it is? <laughs> hey, do you oh, get? Nah. You don't eat, you don't eat no pussy. I'm slow. Man, you lying in hell, man. You got them gold, man. You supposed to be shining that thing up, man. <laughs> where your goals come from? Today, where they come from, man? Just trip, yo, OJ trip. Where your goals come from? Uh, Jaffe or Eddie? They come from Crook. Crook, Crook downtown, right on the other side of Five Point. I know exactly where you. Right, right where the park. Right, 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 that's a fish. That's a fish. That's the other doctor, Jeff. That's where y'all niggas from the cater win. <laughs> What you think about all these rappers in the Illuminati right now? What is Illuminati? I, I drove one of them motherfuckers before, man, and that motherfucker fast. I'm talking about, man, that motherfucker had quad exhaust, man. That bitch faster than the X5. I don't know what the fuck. The I've been seeing, I've been seeing uh, shit on my damn uh, world star look coming, like, watch out for the Illuminati. Is, that motherfucker fast, up. man. Don't be standing in the street. I'm telling you, man. I think all rappers should drive Illuminati. What do you think about uh, the skinny jeans movement and the way rap is moving? That's, that's, that's how they feel. I mean, how do they feel, actually? You know what I'm saying? Like what? Like you know what I'm saying? What do you think about the skinny jeans? You, I mean, you know that. Hey, that's that's that man. Like you know, I can't tell nobody what no baggy jeans if he feel like he want to wear some tight jeans. You know? Okay, I just. <laughs> Take off, bro. You know, I'm not gonna wear no tight jeans. <laughs> can't put my money in my wallet and stuff. Hey, you, know, you get know. ready to have sex. It's hard for you to get your pants over your foot than the girl. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Uh, OJ the Juice Man. 32. 32. That's right. OJ the Juice Man 32. Follow him. Follow me at Shawty Comedian. You know what I'm saying? We keep it popping on Twitter. But uh, what do you think about this new uh, cat stack? Who is it? The cat stack. The chick going around getting with all the industry. Uh, oh, guys sure. then trying to expose them, she get drunk at night, she is a hot mess. Y'all, y'all, look, no. <laughs> oh, did my partner. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? We do this, man. You know what I'm saying? All the time, man. We just bringing it to y'all. You know what I mean? So tell us about all your upcoming projects. You know what I'm saying? Anything you want to get out there, man, before we get up out of here? Uh, you know, I just dropped the realest nigga. I know mixtape is out in the street right now. You know, the Irons mixtape is out. Six Rings is out. Last in the line is out. Live mixtape got them guys. Boulder Credit Day just came out today. You know what I'm saying? Y'all get that guy live mixtape like the fool. You know what I'm saying? Still, I'm um, gonna put out that older Will Jr. story based on the true story. They got it still coming. Fuck with the label talking about. You feel me? Oh, man, throw a nigga on the bus. You know, real nigga shit want to continue to work. We got artists coming out of 32. Lil Dre, Maul, you know what I'm saying? Lil Sock, man. Everybody coming up out that motherfucker. And they got bangers, you know what I'm saying? I can't do nothing but work with it. Cause one thing about it is all about a bag. I'm on this end of the time. You feel me? 32 Entertainment in the motherfucker. Boulder Curve Road. Big shout out to y'all. This your boy OJ the Jew, man. You already know, nigga. Down like four flat tires. All long flat. We can't go nowhere. But it's a lot of suckers, you feel me? But we don't do blow pops over here, you feel me? Real nigga shit.